to us for a second and can be ready. Can't go. Whereas, we are back in that little bit of a drop. Did actually kill off this base. At least for the cancellation. That's a good move there by Bunny. And also, retaining his presence on the map is fantastic for him. All he can do back home is just macro. He's not, he's not facing any pressure. He's constantly keeping his front on the defensive. I think this is going to be a lot of trouble here in a minute, but three, three of them. Well, I mean, sometimes he's looking for those who land on everything. He's getting some ravens as well, but he's getting a few things caught on. Probably the echoes on the way as well, but he really thinks he's a head of that now. Try to play a little bit different than that. I mean, he's going to turn this into the hell not? Why the hell not? Why the hell not? Actually been seen just yet, so he removes himself in that location while he actually applies some pressure over the north here as well, forcing a cancellation once again. Splitco is being constricted, he is being equally as well as he's doing it for just the and he is he is making sure that he can transition into the super late game here with one of the scariest armies for Zerg to deal with. Of course, if Slipco gets himself a great bank, maxing out a corruptors, boom, you actually kill those little battle troops off super quick. But it, I don't think he's gonna get there because he's constantly having his bases tonight. Run is pinning down uh, four bases here, and if both players are going to start acquiring the huge bank. Slipco's bank are much better right now, but Slipco should be attacking here, trying to stop the game out of the game for a good fight. Two more better than Slipco. Please tell me right now. I think this is just good. Like, Slipco doesn't know about battle cruises. He doesn't know anything about the air transition that's on the way. He's trying to deal with these drops every single time, but as these drops continue, he's slowly replacing the Marines with battle cruisers. And Slipco probably thinks he's slowly replacing them with something else. Yes, he's good off, he's going to be right now, but uh, he's not too great. Against the Valkyrie, he do only have three star force so far. Let's go to this one. When he starts basically killing his own SCV, he's going to have such a huge amount of energy. But Stipo is not so much he's still not out of it. He has lots of investors with lots of energy as well. There's no way to come back. With that, he's outsiding on the Ultilus cabin behind this. He's just preparing for every single dynamic he's approaching for him at this point. And we have a little bit of pressure here once again. Nice bit of a drop. And also, where is he trying to land that? No, he's trying oh. to make a hatch on top of the cabin. I'm like a motor. 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 I'm like Ну, давай, давай, давай. 
I'm not going to hit him. So, he just, I think this is all right, by the way. He's just getting his bases back here. He does not need any of the base. Yeah, I'm excited. He's fighting much more than this one. Look at this trade! This is great. Look at this trade here from this bio against those Ultralisks. A fantastic little trade there by the kind of play he not did just yet. And he, oh well, now the Battle Cruisers have indeed been revealed. The, the Corruptors are trying to fly on forward here. Some Seeker Missile is going to be very important. Locks down with Fungals. Tries to take this engagement slowly here. Infested Terrans as well. The Hunt's Seeker Missiles go out on the Corruptors. Will they be able to annihilate them? Is the question. They move into the fray. Oh, the Hunt Corruptors actually go down. And the with that, it looks like he's going to try and continue, but he has no anti-air. These Battle Cruisers are going to ransack this army if they get the opportunity. All the Infested Terrans have gone. There's no more anti-air here. The Battle Cruisers are going to continue, continue forward. Kill off the lot. They're actually killing forward. He's going to yam out those shots on those blue lords. Yeah. 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 yeah, this <laughs> this just got celestial. Uh, was that? That was like TV. Let's see. Oh. 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 Okay, yeah, we've got the chat turned off for uh, broadcasting purposes here so that we can uh, keep this as clear as possible. But that is going to do mm -hmm. it. Slipco is eliminated, realizing that those battle cruisers kind of got the only thing that was in the game. That was in the game, but maybe that's blue guy. Oh my god. Battle cruisers against blue mods. Apparently, the blue mods don't win. And secret missiles against corruptors. Didn't do too badly either. Yeah, uh, but he could have done better. If he sent lots of people to do it, he could have done well, but he wasn't able to do it. He knew that he was going to fight. I guess he's very hard to do it. He just didn't know that you're a punch transition. Oh, that was quite happy. And again, there was the synergy of transitioning into that battle cruiser play while still constricting his opponent from being able to build a bank. If the bank is going to build that in strict mode, he will rematch on corruptors so fast. Just an on him, Jim. So many corruptors that they're not going to get corruptors at the end of the angle. The punk seeker missiles are not going to do it. I'm very impressed with this. Yep, revenge time. It is revenge time. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, yes, he is. Three hundred. Pretty much three hundred. So that was that is that is going to be crazy, guys. All right, that is going to do it. Unfortunately, BP Bank is going to just fall down to challenger. Okay, my good buddy. You, we are going to go on to four GG versus Bunny. The rematch here is dark and full of Terrans. We'll be back in just a little bit here. WCS EU. Myself, Kyle Aris. Mas que a gente fez Když jsem se na skoro opravil, tak mě dodělal. 
Пятка. A on prakticky vyháze všechny kombat, co můžeš. Tedy v kombatu, dokud se nedaj dát. No hook? Řetěz. Řetěz, chytne ho do hlavu, vyskočí na něj a chytku do hlavy. Proč mi zůstane ten živo nezabíjet, jo?
we have the final series of the night here, and what a series. We opened with it, we're going to be closing with it. This is a rematch. Bunny out for Richard Out for revenge. Will he be able to do it? Depends on how many of the CDs can do. As you say, the match is got full of fans. Um, you know what I mean? You shouldn't be. You not to do it from the game. Split up wherever you go, guys. Spread into the woods. Dash. Go away. Those hellbats, man. They do cause quite a lot of damage. Here. This, 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 but this is basically a tennis match between Roger Federer and me. I'm not sure what they're going to do too well against Roger Federer, but hey, he's going to make this work. He is the best at all. He's 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 the best at all. That would be pretty amazing. I thought you were going to talk about the first game instead of the game that you were going to do. Are you on about like a three-episode long Kamehameha long where yes. both of them are fighting that way and that way? I that happens to time. Okay, guys, jump in. Game number one. We do have spawning of two of the top left-hand corner once again as our two Terran. Looking to vanquish a titan here. He is Copenhagen Wolves. But Oh. Just for gas first. Yeah, I guess we're very good. Anyway. Up on the intro. As we do our spawning down the bottom right hand corner here. As our yeah. red Terran. He goes by the name of Millennium 4GG. May I say pop? Pleasure to have you here. Pleasure to have you in Cologne. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. 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 I'm Jste mohli stihnout ty snad máte hodinu a zatím to děláte 25 minut. Somebody's gonna do it, and then it's gonna be like, I forgot about that. This is gonna get like every SCP. As vaše nikoli kastře jsou ani ten. Any method is available to him, apparently. But he has that the only accent, so he's gonna switch out from back three and probably get some Hellion down. Whilst Benzi transitioning on to Flo Banshee here. And whilst we have 4GG who is just playing his his full 5% build. And oh, oh that's why he was getting this. Alright. Tristá. Takže čtyřista vteřin. Na jedno. Na. Čerešní tebe, tak za čtyřista vteřin můžu jít sem znova. Na to má. Definitely is a possibility with a scan with the barracks. He, make, he should make sure he shouldn't lose it like Buddy did. That set him back a little bit uh, in that game number one. Uh, but these are basically for Buddy the fastest Hellbats that you can get. 4 g is trying to defend against this with Widow Mines. It's a great choice. It's going to work out pretty darn well. He's had a new time for here as well. It's going to be game number one all over again. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Actually, neither player is coming. Fortune is going to be the only one to get a good scout done. He's the two Hellions, followed by the Flying Dance. 
And as you can see, the of the port is behind you, so you never go for a fire. You can't stop it if you go for a fire. Oh, really? so annoying. Those Hellions are posing a little bit of a threat at the front of the base here. Before you do, just poking around. Uh, hasn't seen the Hellbats yet, though. And that won't matter if you can Double maybe back. Four Hellbats. Yeah. He's, he's basically... I think what he's doing here is he's ex expecting his opponent to have opened up with a pretty quick expansion and then tried to get that as well as the main. Oh, this is just a straight... Oh, I think Prophecy must have seen this... Uh, yeah. Really right now, he's going to be seeing the same thing. When Korean barbecue or Danish steak, what we're about to find out. Those robots now on the way for Bunny. Bacon currently taking a little bit of a lead, and he actually cl clips one of those uh, medevacs there. And four hellbats actually cause a lot of hurt here. He's going to lose one of his medevacs. He loses the second one as well. Those hellbats not helping out. Yeah, I guess clean up. <laughs> and how many? One worker. One is killed. I'm not pressing. He's not that strong. Or dangerous. He's going to go for it again, though. What's up with the barracks? So he landed it there. I guess there was a Viking, but he's going to take. Oh, oh, GG, I thought he pulled the SCVs against the bear, but he's just going to be repairing uh, yeah. his Hellbat for the moment. I think 4GG is safe pretty much yeah. anymore now, but four more Hellbats are about to be dropped.